all right, so nerve flushing. Now, uh, if, you, if you're like a therapist that, that knows, you probably know about the slump test uh, to stretch the sciatic nerve to see if it's a sciatic, you know, this sort of thing. We don't want to do that because that is stretching it to bring on the symptoms. Okay, so what we're going to do is extend the knee. Okay, I'm going to show you in a second. Extend the knee as you extend the head. Okay, so if I just come back here, you really want the person uh, on something where they can, because what we want to do is bend the knee and bend the knee, flex the toe and the foot all the way as we flex the head. So keeping neutral spine still. So we extend the head as we extend the knee. And then, just do that. See, I don't know whether you can see it, but my, my legs are on the side of this chair here. So, okay, so just remember, both flex, both extend. So, okay, so I just go extend. And so my feet, I'm pulling my toes up to really mobilize the sciatic nerve, okay? Just like dental floss through your teeth, same thing, we're flossing, nerve flossing. So, now also get them to make sure that they really look up, uh, really extend their head, okay? So, and then really flex as much as possible. 10 repetitions, all right? So again, just remember, with nerve flossing, it can stir up that nerve. So if it does, it's too early, don't bring it on. But obviously, if they find, oh, that's really helped, you know, the next day I've got much less, then they can continue doing, I say, just 10 repetitions, you don't need much, because they, they you probably know, nerves can get irritated very, very quickly. So there you are, there's another tool in your toolbox. All of the other stuff we talked about, you're doing. Um, but you can add that in as well.